Hello there, Libra and Libra Rising. This is going to be your uh, November the 20... Or, sorry, this is going to be your November love forecast for the month of November. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and cut these cards. I'm going to go ahead and put them into quarters. It's going to be two for the first quarter, two for the second quarter, two for the third quarter, and two for the fourth quarter. And we're going to see exactly what wants to come out in terms of your month and in terms of moving forward for you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and just start cutting these cards here. And we're just going to see exactly what wants to come out. And here we go. We actually have some cards here. Let me think. Oh, they actually came out like that. But for some reason, they're wanting me to turn them over. So we're going to go ahead and go like that. And let's go ahead and see what else wants to come out here for you guys. We have this card that wanted to come out in terms of this one as well. Let's go ahead and just keep on going here. And there we go. We're going to go ahead and just put them straight off the top there. We'll go ahead and just see what wants to come out for you guys, okay? Anyway, so we have so we have the first card here is the Temperance in Reverse, saying, honest to goodness, you're going to be able to experience a whole lot of happiness and joy in terms of this month without really having to put so much effort into it. The Temperance card is a really, really strong card saying, hey, 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 you're going to be able to relax while also getting a whole lot of stuff done. And in Reverse here, it's just really saying that you're really going to be able to experience everything everything that you would like to do and without really having to put so much effort into it. You're going to really have that fire energy and that, and that, and that water energy. At the same time, you're not really going to have to do too much. It's going to be sort of kind of effortless for you. So it's going to be a very, very effortless month in terms of love, but at the same time being able to experience all this absolutely wonderful energy while being able to experience it in the way that you would really like to. So honestly, this is a very, very strong card saying, hey, hey, you don't, you don't really got to worry so much. You can just relax and do everything that you would like to do. Next card here is the Two of Coins in Reverse, saying, honest to goodness, you're going to be able to sort of kind of balance it in, in the way that you'd like to balance. But at the same time, it's it's going to be sort of kind of balanced its own way. This is going to be a time where you're really going to be able to relax and really see things work out in your favor. And honest to goodness, with the Two of Coins coming out here, this is a situation where you're really going to be able to sort of kind of do everything that you want to do in the way that you really want to do it. This is a very, very strong card saying, hey, 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 enjoy yourself and really, really feel this absolutely wonderful energy that's meant for you to feel in the way that you would like to. So enjoy yourself in terms of Two of Coins energy because it's really all about you enjoying yourself and doing the things that you would really, really like to do. This card here is the Seven of Cups saying, hey, 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 enjoy yourself in the absolutely best way this month because honest to goodness, you're really going to be able to choose the things that you want to choose, but they're actually just going to be sort of kind of showed to you. It's a very, very strong situation saying, hey, 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 you're really going to be able to start feeling this wonderful energy and at the same time being able to do everything that you would like to do as well. This is a very, very strong card saying, hey, feel really great and feel really wonderful because with the Seven of Cups coming out here, you're really going to be able to get all these decisions shown to you in the best way possible, in the most wonderful way possible, in the way that's going to make you feel the best. Next card here is the Nine of Cups in reverse, saying, honest to goodness, this wish of yours is going to start coming true and maybe in potentially in an unexpected way. This is going to be a time where you're really going to be able to really, really figure out this wish of yours, and it's really going to be able to sort of kind of just move in the right direction and really just make you feel wonderful while it's moving there. It's going to really make you feel great. And honest to goodness, the Nine of Cups energy coming up here is something that's really going to be able to make you feel like your wish is coming true. The page of coins here coming out, though, is really saying that you're really, in terms of third quarter of the month, you're really going to be able to listen to your emotions and really feel all this wonderful energy all at the same time. It's going to make you feel absolutely wonderful, and it's really going to make you feel like everything is sort of kind of moving in the right direction, moving in the way that you would like to experience it, and at the same time, sort of kind of doing the things that you would like to do while it's getting done. It's going to be a very, very strong card saying, hey, 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 hey. Feel that absolutely wonderful energy and feel that wonderful um, and feel that wonderful coins energy sort of kind of getting you exactly what you want to do and showing you how to get there. It's going to be something that's going to be an absolutely fantastic, fantastic, fantastic read to really just be able to be like, hey, you can really just understand everything that's sort of kind of coming at you. And while at the same time doing everything that you would really, really like to do as well. So really, really enjoy that situation because it's really coming at you quicker than you may understand. 
This card here is the Eight of Coins, saying you're going to really be able to work on your mastery. And whenever I say work on your mastery, I mean do it big time. This is going to be something that's really going to be able to make you realize exactly what you need to do to get exactly what you need done, done. And I mean get it done in a very, very good way. This mastery is going to be a very, very strong card, saying you're going to be able to do exactly what you'd like to do in the way that you'd like to do it with the feelings that are going to be attached to it as well. So feel really, really great about this energy because honest to goodness, it wants you to big, 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 big time. So anyways, this paint is no more. And honest to goodness, it's really going to be sort of kind of erased from any type of understanding in terms of the fourth quarter of the month. Because, because in terms of the situation, you really need to feel absolutely fantastic about everything. And it's really just going to be able to feel really, really good all at the same time. So enjoy yourself and feel really, really great this month because you're really going to be able to feel this wonderful, wonderful no paint energy and really just be able to start enjoying yourself in a way that's sort of kind of easy and relaxing. Uh, to the soul, actually. <laughs> so, anyways, yes, yeah, so to start enjoying, so I start enjoying this wonderful energy of just being able to not, to not really having to experience any type of pain and be able to really experience all that happy, wonderful energy at the same time. Next card here is Strength in Reverse, saying, honest to goodness, in terms of the fourth quarter of the month, you're really going to be able to really, really relax, and it's going to be a very relaxing situation for you guys. You're going to be able to experience all this absolutely wonderful energy, and it's not really going to have to take so much too much effort. It's going to be a very effortless month, and it's really going to be able to allow you to sort of kind of relax, and just sort of kind of glide and relax into everything that you would like to relax into. So in terms of Strength card here, just start enjoying yourself and really, really start feeling all that wonderful energy where exactly where it's supposed to go, exactly where it needs to go. And honest to goodness, with the Strength card here in reverse feel really really great that it's really sort of kind of moving in that right direction and, and it's allowing you to experience everything in the way that you would like to experience as well so start enjoying that wonderful strength energy and start really just feeling really really great about everything that's going on around you because honest to goodness everything everything is really just working so you can really just relax and really be able to enjoy everything in the best way possible <laughs> so anyways enjoy yourself and start feeling the absolutely wonderful energy because honest to goodness it's really gonna make you feel absolutely fantastic okay anyways I'm Kristen Vatic here, and I also do private readings. I can do $75 for a 60-minute Skype session reading, $50 for a 30-minute Skype session reading, or $35 for a private YouTube session, sort of kind of just like this, but for your specific need or issue. I'm also running a sale this month, so you can contact me at kristenvatic at yahoo.com or Kristen.